Howdy folks, hope you're all doing well. Decided I was going to do a little stream because kind of wanted to rank up the natural roll just a little bit more and I wanted to just hang out for a little bit. So who's in the chat? Hey, oh, we got Wrath, uh, Wraith Skell, how are you getting on? Rick Patrick, is it? Rick Ratrick, is that an R? And uh, Groovy, how are you getting on people? Hope you're all doing well. I just realized I had a treasure map and I think I'm close around this area so I'm gonna do this quickly um, I'm not in the area not a big deal Let's see if I got treasure map over this side to just cancel that out uh, purple P pidkin how are you getting on Amelia hey uh, East Watson that'll do I don't particularly like the East Watson's treasure map, but it's in the area, so I said I might as well. <laughs> morning. It's uh, evening over here, but morning to you, Ray. Diablo Ridge is close as well. It is indeed. I think East Watson was the closest. Before I head off, camp is just here. So I was doing a small bit of sampling to get the the natural roll ranked up. I bought a lot of um, pamphlets as they were on sale. So I bought a lot and I've got like only 267 cash at the moment. Alright, let's see if I can make a proper stew. Don't have a lot of stuff though, unfortunately, but we'll see what we have. Oh yeah, we actually can make it. That'll do. When you know you're going to be in free roam for a while, it's always decent to check that. It's 4.13. Oh, it is exactly quarter past four here. Yeah, I, I think I learned a lot of the map based off the treasure maps. I think, just the locations and stuff. Alright, um, let me see. Just before I head on, I want to see where Crips is. Z-Wing, how are you getting on? Oh, we'll do a three supply actually. Yeah, I'll do this. We're still. I'm still actually have to rank up the treasure roll and this character as well. Stranded at the mercy of brigands and outlaws, so we can play nice or we can play smart, and you aren't very good at playing nice. And doing these are usually some of the best XP to kind of help rank it up. Tip away with it anyway. We're off to a broken down wagon. So I actually have a new, uh, I had to update my OBS after the last day. I'm always so slow to update the OBS. It, well, OBS for those who don't know is the streaming software and I'm always a little slower to update it because it just causes trouble. So I had to take a few hours yesterday just to get everything sorted. But it is nice when it works. It's just, and it's a free software as well, so can't really complain too much. That's exactly what you, you need it to do when it works. Oh, forgot I... So I have my cards um, set up. Not as normal. I have my cards set up for um, legendaries, legendary animals.
Nice. Oops, the Billy Car shift coming. Yeah, I, I decided to just leave it. It's not a huge deal. When you're doing a lot of sampling and like um trying to knock off legendary animals, it's better to have these kind of cars. Plus, I want to rank them up while I'm. So yeah, I want to rank them up because they're all only level one. So I'll leave them on for a while. But I'm earning a bit of XP. Silky girl gaming. I came back to play Red Dead from GTA because Mafia is more alive. Yeah, uh, yeah, GTA San Los Santos kind of does feel a little bit dated. I think I always have a pet peeve when it comes to GTA about the the way they programmed the vehicles to purposely come out and pull out in front of you. It's just one of those things that has always annoyed me. Um, because it's kind of like artificially trying to create and slow you down from progressing. And it's just so tedious. I think one of the last times when I was giving up on GTA was a car just pulled out of me in a crossroads. And I was like, that's it. I'm done. <laughs> you know? Um, I can, I cannot pronounce your name as it, as it kids, is it? As it kids. Oh yeah. Welcome to stream. How are you getting on? Kenny says, trying to catch up because I haven't played since the planet. Really? I, have, I didn't get a lot. I didn't get a lot of gaming time over December, unfortunately. So, kind of making it up now. Looking at uh, a few games coming up next year. my downtime I watched uh, I never I was talking about it in the last stream as well but I haven't like uh, I have zero interest in Harry Potter but after seeing the new game that's coming up over December I watched all the movies <laughs> never seen them before I had no idea what, I just like to look at the game kind of thing looks like it could be cool so now I have at least a base knowledge of the game I said your name correctly awesome feed my horse before someone in the comments tells me to feed my horse. It's like probably the most uh, requested most requested thing for me to do on live stream. Feed my horse. Well done. There we'll sell a little. I'll just keep a timer so I know when there's another resupply coming. Um, let me see what the status is on. I could do a sale. I'll even build up a little bit. We get the best of stuff now because I know I'm going to be in free roam a little bit. Uh, yeah. Actually, I do have a nice legendary sample to give Harriet. I'll keep an eye out. I think I'll do the, the grasslands. There's a few. I think I have to get a few foxes. So. Although, maybe I'll just head over to the swamp and just grind out the, the alligators. It's another way of doing it. Hey Jackie, I didn't see you there. How are you getting on?
sell on some stuff. But uh, to be honest, that's it. I'm actually even going to be streaming. I wanted to stream on Sunday, but unfortunately something came up. But I will. I'm gonna set up my Xbox so I can play Red Dead One. It's definitely overdue. I think that'd be kind of cool to stream. You've been carrying yourself well out there. Word travels fast. Let me see what you've collected. I wonder what bears dream about in their long winters. Must be a profound experience. Did I swap out my ability cards yet? No, I won't be. I'll leave them like this. Keep your heart open. I won't be doing a lot of um. A uh, lot of like shooting for like in NPCs, so I should be okay. If I do some, if I do something, I will switch them. But for the most part, it's not a big deal. Fallen Order has taken over my life today. Oh, the Star Wars game. It looks pretty good. I haven't played it, but I did see that's also on my, my radar. I was kind of hoping that the new Fallen Order 2 is going to be like open world, because that would definitely be on my radar if it is. Less than nine, it's like a less than nine Dark Souls. Yeah, I think they took a few of the mechanics from kind of like the Dark Souls style, which is never a bad thing. They're a bit more generous with how you, uh, when you die and stuff. I was thinking of the wrong way. <clears throat> Morning, Jess. How are you getting on? Why do I have so many markers? Because I just never take them off. Uh, it was from, if I remember, I'm pretty sure it's from when we were down in Mexico, I think. Yeah, it's from down in Mexico. So when someone was saying about RDR1, so. There was two ways to get across, either over here, or over here. Actually, did I? Oh yeah, I even had this little video prepped for it, like, so this was how you get over to Mexico. So we used to, um... Your voice sounds like it's from the bottom of a well. Hmm. One sec, I'm gonna have to check that. It should be alright. Just double check to make sure. Anybody else having issues with the audio today? Right. No, it seems to be fine. You sure it's um just my channel, or you having issues with? Yeah, I I had a listen. But yeah, we had a little excursion to Mexico, so there were some sort of um, places I wanted to visit to, because we kind of went through. I think we did on a stream as well. Let's go. We had a fight club <laughs> over at the the castle. Fort, I guess it would be more of a fort than a castle. Yeah, thanks for everyone for the feedback on the audio. Glad it's coming through, all right. And uh, sorry about your speaker, whoever. Sounds like your speaker might be a bit iffy. Timer overlay. Yeah, uh, I had it, so um, I was programming. I programmed it in today. And I programmed in a few of them, but there's a slight little problem with the little audio bell that happened at the end. 
So I have to go back to my code. But yeah, I do. It's weird. I, for someone that doesn't stream a lot, I do enjoy my overlays. So like, I enjoyed like doing all this. Oh, I never talked about this actually. Okay. So I enjoy doing making. I enjoy making overlays and stuff like that. And um, that was the other. I think this was the first one I ever did. That was like the first um stream thing I ever created. I wanted to make a like a projector. In my mind, it was like uh, I thought it'd be cool to be able. To Zoom in and kind of talk to the camera sometimes. I always hate the way he never particularly looks at the thing. You can hear it too. <laughs> yeah, it's fun too. To take a little time to make with. Take, take cool. Programmed in, uh, I think, yeah, the members would have seen it as well. I programmed. I didn't want to buy a stream deck because it didn't do what I wanted, so I programmed the keyboard to do what I wanted. Ren is here. How are you getting on? Trying to get your character to look at the camera sucks, yeah. It's like they just they resist. <laughs> it's like almost like passive aggressive. I might not see you again. Please take a look. Yeah, we're still rank five. Actually, you know what? It's not rank five. I might as well just grab some. I just can't tell you. There's pigs in the chat. Hey, there, pigs. Hey, pigs. Yeah, I'm gonna just whack some. Whack some gators. I think I um, came across a legendary gator as well recently enough, so unfortunately I'm not going to get one today. Because it'll take three days, real world days, to, to get those respawn for you. I'm playing, oh god, you're playing, uh, I am. That said, a lot of the games I'm looking at coming up in 2023, I'm looking at on PC. I just don't play Rockstar games on PC. Well, I don't play the online versions of them on PC anyway. I'll play the single player on PC, but not the, the online. Till they, till Rockstar hires some decent net coders so they can create actual create some sort of security that like a 12 year old can't break till that xbox is i don't know xbox and playstation are I think, more or less the same there's very little difference i've never really kind of understood the console wars the only thing I like, I'll give credit to the Xbox, though, is um, th when it came to back catalog, playing back catalog games, they just, they nailed that. Like, that was the, that's the one thing that Sony just dropped the ball on that. Like, I had to get an Xbox just so I could play a remastered version of RDR1. You going into the water now, Croc? I think we can get more.
better exclusives. Yeah, I think that's. I think that's the only real, the way they can differentiate themselves is the exclusives. I mean, other than that, like I, I've like always had PlayStations, but like it's, it, to me, when I'm buying another console, it makes no real difference to me. Like, um, I guess what it really comes down to is if you play online games, you know, if you play with a lot of people that play on your console, it might be hard for you to transfer over. But in general, if you just if you just play single players, I don't think it's much into the way of difference between them. Damn, that's a nice horse. Oh, thank you. Still covered in Not a long crap journey, at the moment. A trade? What do you propose? Use as well. There's no shortage of rabbits. Friends, but no less important. Thank you for the risk you took in getting this. It will add greatly to my studies. How am I actually doing with the control uh, best audio at 12 times 50 okay we have another little she'll have another few um Good luck. I'll have to sleep a few more um crocs before yeah. ghost butter water dehydrating are you ghost butter Might actually go somewhere. I'm not sure if they're the same with this left. Uh, I love all platform or JDM, JDM, MAs, JDM. So you have all the platforms. I just play more on Xbox. Yeah. Well, not ever like if you can afford them all. Obviously, that would probably be the best solution. But I think it really does come down to if you have a, a network of people that you like to play with. But I am looking forward. Like I had to, had to bar, like a barda. My friend, has, my friend um, is a huge gamer. Has a like basically a wall dedicated to different consoles. And he gave me a lot of one of these spare Xboxes, so I can play um, Red Dead One. Which unfortunately, I haven't done yet. Um, it's almost like a little museum. When you see setup, it's pretty cool. Star Wars, yeah. Uh, I think Star Wars is cool. I like the lore. Yeah. I found myself going down when it comes to Star Wars. I found myself like, like I've I have friends who would be huge fans and they've like seen all the movies multiple times. I might have seen them maybe once or twice. And but I have got like, um, do you ever like go down a rabbit hole where you just kind of um, just watch, just find a topic and then before you know it, you're like watching thing video or video after of the same topic over before until you become like an expert on it. I've I've watched a lot of Star Wars lore for some reason. <laughs> just maybe over the space of like a week. <laughs> a while back, I just started watching them. I haven't got like uh as I said I've watched a lot of Harry I watched all the Harry Potter movies but I haven't gone down into the lore like I never really got drawn it that far into it I kind of just wanted to get a good um foothold for when the game comes out so at least I'm not completely blind I guess Jackie says my favorite Star Wars fact is that the purple light yeah they weren't. Samuel L. Jackson wanted a purple life lifesaver. Samuel L. Jackson got one.
Bam. Isn't like when was the first Star Wars out? Was it like Oh, it's gonna be it was it like the first movie out in the seventies? There's definitely gonna be someone more knowledgeable in the comments to me on that, but it's been around for so many years, like decades at this stage, that's like it's got a deep, rich lore behind it, like. Early eighties, I thought. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. I, like as in I it's around that time. I wasn't sure if the seventies was too I'm not sure if it was like late seventies. Seventy seven. There we go. <laughs> Thanks, Carcana. I'm not gonna lie. The reason I guessed that was just the, the footage of it. Just how the footage looks. Um I have this was actually my approach at it. Did any of you see the difference in the you see the difference? So this was my um color grading. So I wanted to make the uh the game look a bit more like a spaghetti western. Which again, like early we were kinda of like early seventies, a lot of that kind of filmography and stuff. But um that's the kind of color grade to have, this kind of sunburn kind of look to them. Uh, did I hear about the open world Star Wars game in development? Are you talking about Jedi Fallen Order? Is that the one? The second? Um, yeah, uh, I watched like I watched the Game Awards, and I picked off a few games that I'm kind of interested in picking up over this year. I'm gonna get. Am I gonna get eaten? No. Survived. Spaghetti loves. Yeah. Yeah, I actually wasn't, um, I wasn't a huge Western fan until Red Dead 1 came, so I was a huge GTA fan, and then they dropped Red Dead 1, and then I became, kind of, I started really like the, the Western genre, then I started kind of, I went out through all the scary Westerns, I always preferred like, um, spaghetti Westerns over, like, as in, they had this kind of interesting, like, low-budget soundtrack, which just was awesome. Like, they, like you'd know it when you hear it, like, um, like, the good, the bad, the ugly and stuff. It's like they were competing against these really big Hollywood budgets, so that had orchestras and big names. And then they had, like, at the start, anyway, they had these gritty, <laughs> gritty locations where they went over to, like, Italy to film because <laughs> it was cheaper and stuff. Ours. Don't be ignoring me, boy. Is that a gator right beside me? <laughs> I just legged last one. <laughs> I felt the guy. I knew I felt something on my toes. I think I stepped on him. I was living dangerously. We're gonna get three bites of <laughs> getting lit up by gators. I'm still going strong. All right, come out here, you. <laughs> nice. 
for it. I even marinated myself with some moonshine for them. Just to give an extra an extra bite to the Tyler they were eating. <laughs> I wanted to see if I could run out. I had like to set my own little mission there. Oh. This guy has to be waking up shortly. He's just gonna wake up and boy, he's gonna eat me as soon as I uh... <laughs> Yeah, tempt and fair. Like it's not something I do in real life. In real life you wouldn't even catch me in the same state as where there's alligators, like not a mind. But yeah, you wouldn't even catch me in the same state. I do not like him. We don't have like anything over here that would be any bit dangerous, really. These things are dinosaurs like. Yeah, your legs got tired. When I was, Jackie says, when I was in Florida. Where? Where? Where did get this for it? Oh. You slept too many. Uh, when you were in Florida, or Florida, you shut. They shut down the outdoor PRs because the gator was not cool. Just hanging out, was it? I'll come back and get those gators right there. Hopefully, she doesn't get rescued in the meantime. Wait, like I've seen clips on of like people in Florida just dealing with gators and like, some dude was walking into his kitchen and there's like a gator after getting through the, the cat flap or something like a little one or a dog they just like I don't know I don't think I could handle that Just on. He was just on holiday, just enjoying a little swim, you know. happens when I'm trying to keep an eye on the chat but um I actually I really think the, the natural role could have been just I think it was a good idea but it's badly executed all right let's see what you have for me they may look vicious but they're just fulfilling their role in the cycle I should probably check to see. You've been on your best behavior, I'm told. Lord is no good. 
Joker getters, yeah. I know the Nile is terrible with crocodiles as well. Like, you see people walking around with missing arms and legs. They, like, they just have to you know, clean their clothes with the water. And crocodiles know this, like, just sit there and wait for them. Um, Let's see. Beaver. Grey, silver, red, silver. Not sure which one. That's the red, isn't it? Oh no, that's the silver. Is that the red? Bear. Let's see if I got any bears in. I don't think I've got a moose yet. Let me see what you've collected. Nature's predators keep the balance. A far cry from hunter's rifles. Hello. Hmm. Thought I got bears. Howdy, Roger. How are you getting on? It's going well. How's things going with you? Let's see. Oh, yeah. I'll have a lot more here. Oh, timber wolf. This one's pretty easy, actually. Wolves, timber wolf. Timber wolf's probably the only one that. Hmm. Let's see if I can. Wouldn't mind getting a collection. Not that I need to, but just. Uh. What do you propose? Uh, Every mammal I meet feels like looking in a mirror. I bet this was a feisty little critter. Gods among us, these incredible creatures. How anyone could kill them, wear them. I don't understand it. Poor thing. Hope it doesn't miss this. You just finished that roll. Uh, the naturalist one. Yeah, it's not the one that most people kind of go out of their way to do. Uh, that's the ram. Okay. I'll be able to get that here. Get them over near forest. Get them over near Emerald. Get them on my way down port, just north of Valentine. Just come across wolves, I guess. I wonder if it worked Very in. much enjoyed the alligators around here. Mm. Good luck. I might give it a go. I'll do another another round of gators first. Or, yeah. You like the natural roll picks? Yeah, I, th I think it got a lot of shtick. Um, and I do understand that, like, everybody was hoping for heists and stuff. But I think it got a lot of shtick. A lot of people love... I've never been a huge fan of the hunting this game, but I know a lot of people are. And I can, like, I think this had a lot of potential, especially when it came to, like, the idea of legendary animals. Um, I just think the uh, you know, it's kind of annoying that it's always the same hat or that the, the coat with the same head, like, is in. I just wish that you were able to, like, hunt down you know, for gloves and vests and stuff like that, you know? Like, they have that stuff in single player, so it would have been cool to have that kind of brought in. Good good afternoon, Ducky. Good afternoon, Franklin. Ducky. Isn't that very, um, Midlands, UK? I think that's where I heard it. Not a good time to knock me off, horse.
materials required. Yeah, I like the wolves and the cats. Oh, so yeah. So, Jackie was disappointed with legendary animals. Yeah, like the... Like even that, like the hoods should be separate. It's kind of a nine. You have to use a glitch. Might as well get this. A blood money. Or blood money. It's a blood flower. Might as well grab it while it's there. I think we get two more gators. I'll go see if I can knock a collection. Oh, looks like she either got eaten or saved. Either way, I don't mind. Pixie says, I'd rather have gloves and a vest than a sink. Yeah. yeah. Zachary, welcome to the chat. Sorry, Zachary. It's not overly easy to game and to read comments as easy. I usually just try to pick out a few comments that I can see, but um, it's not the easiest. <laughs> if you don't believe me, just watch me smack into a, a tree while I'm riding a horse. I'm trying to read the comments. Multitasking has never been my strong suit. I hope you're doing well. What were you asking? When does Dunce health come back? I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah. What's my favorite Claude voice? Uh, um, yeah, I think. Does he even grunt? He doesn't even grunt, does he? Clawed speed. Alright, dirty old. Catch you later. Alright, Roger. Thanks for stopping by. Hey, Master Chief. Do I have five? Four. I think I saw someone over here that looks tired. Sure that I'm actually ranking this roll up as well. But yeah, unfortunately, <laughs> I don't know why I find that so funny. The guy's just like chilling out, walking up. He's <laughs> like he's just out for a stroll or something. Here, I'll brighten it up for you as well. I know you. This game can get quite dark. Which I like when you're playing single player. It adds to the mood and stuff. But it can be hard to see in the stream. Alright, I'm going to grab a few. 
gonna see if I can do at least one collection. Get all my stamps. See how that goes. Yeah, my man. Hello. How are you getting on? What's new with this game? Um, there isn't. Uh, huge. There isn't like any huge new content, but there is like a, an event month, so there's like bonuses on, so I can get double cash and XP on trader sales and channel sales. And, you know, there's a few limited time clothing items back and stuff like that, but no major updates. Don't predict any for the next year, anyway. Unless we hear an announcement for... Unless we hear an announcement for, um... Next gen. I don't think we're gonna get an update. Where am I from, Rudolph? I am from Ireland. Gracias. No worries. That's no nada. I'm told. Or is it no nada? No nada. There we go. You were brave for getting this sample. Which Thank game you. is everyone anticipating? I think um, Hogwarts is probably the one I'm looking forward to. I don't think. I'm trying to think now. I had a short list. I can't remember what it is. I'm gonna have to double check my. I had a short list that I was kind of hoping for. Have a look. I can find it on the fly. Very much enjoyed the alligators round here. More intelligent than they're given credit for. Yeah, I can't. Oh, here. Uh, let me think so we have oh yeah i forgot about that suicide squad if that's going out this year i'll be looking for, uh, um if i can get my hands in a credit card number i might grab a uh, crime boss rocket city for the crack um yeah suicide squad um i think there's a new cyberpunk DLC come in as well, and then Star Wars Jedi, and uh, Hogwarts. I think they're the ones that I'm keeping my eye on now. What games are you all looking forward to this year? <laughs> it's not a it's not a Tyler stream without Jackie mentioning Monster Hunter. But uh, yeah, that's gone. Out. It's not really a, a game that I've really played, or I'm not sure. Not sure it's something I'd be looking forward to. Oh, Ark Two. Yeah, I didn't even think Arc Two was coming out this year, but yeah, if Arc Two comes out, then that that would be that would shoot to the top of my list. Um, let me think. So, what am I looking for? Actually, I'm gonna see if I can grab it. Here. Oh no, I'll get the boars actually in the, in the woods probably. I'm gonna head over to grab some buffalo or bison. Oh, what am I doing? Not not thinking. I need to restock my ammo. You've been carrying yourself well out there. Word. A must. But be careful. These can be lethal to the smaller critters. Arc 2 has too many delays. I'm caution optimistic. Uh, yeah, um, I don't know. I'm like 50-50 on it. Like, I don't know if it's going to be awesome or if it's going to be really bad. Um, it's hard to know. As in, there's a, like, it, it almost sounds like a different game that's coming. Well, it's going to be only third person, which is kind of annoying because I play in first person on Arc. And... Uh, they said it's gonna be like what Assassin's Creed. It's gonna also have elements of um, the um, Souls kind of games as well. It doesn't sound like Ark. Like, uh, but we'll see. Spider Man. There, is, Spider Man isn't skewed up for 2023, is it? If there was a new, if yeah, if there was a new Spider Man, that would be on my hit list as well. I thought that'd be 2024 though. 
I think Suicide Squad's the only like C game. Or the only kind of superhero game I'd be interested in this year. No. But yeah, the Spider Man games are really good. There's really good core games. Buffalo here. Probably get the timber wolf there. Keep an eye out for boars. I head down. Should be able to get the. I think it's around there if my memory serves. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it's here. No, it wouldn't be. There's like a little rocky area in one of these. I think it could be. I think it's here. All trees. Yeah, I think it's around there. I can get the big horns. And what else was there? I heard a wolf or I heard a box. That's a red one too. Need your sample, Fox. I don't usually revive. The only ones I kind of revive are legendaries if I was trying to get like, um, everything so i want to photograph them and stuff i often just sleep them and then when then i check and see if what i need to do and if i need to photograph them i'll revive them then photograph them but i don't even have the camera on this character so i'm not too fast uh what is the timer for for this one oh that was just the resupplies but i think it's been negated by the materials for Horizon Forbidden West streams. Yeah, I played them. Um, I thought they were good games. I don't know if they made for good streams, though. I didn't get a huge... Um, they were, they're good games. Yeah, will I be streaming? Yeah, I'm not sure if I'll be streaming, but I plan to cover other games anyway. Uh, I might stream more on Dirty Cypher, just because I don't really care about that channel so if I'm like jumping on I might just jump on and just mess about with some games that too which I might only play like for a couple of hours and Bison. I don't know buzz There was a lot of bison there. It always annoyed me they're not worth as much. Like that bison pelt should be worth a lot. Got another grassland. Doing well. Would y'all be interested in seeing a um, Red Dead 1 stream? I have to kind of set it up. I shouldn't hopefully be too much effort. I'm kind of looking forward to it. I'm just kind of trying to figure out what kind of structure I'm doing. Cause I think two hours is a nice time for a stream. But I don't know. <laughs> it's part of me that thinks if I start playing that, I might just get lost in the life. RDR wants to win. Killer Vic, thanks. Yeah, RDR won. What are the pins for? 
I'm gonna have to take him. I'm gonna have to take him off because he keeps asking. There, it was from a trip to Mexico. I think I think I kind of still feel like I wasn't paying attention. Am I going the right way? Ah, yeah. Um, it was from my trip to Mexico. I feel like I want to head down there again, but. The thing that annoyed me the most about this is that you can't do private lobbies in this game um, with more than six people, which is kind of a nine. So I like to kind of have a little control over the lobbies and stuff. Uh, the bison's always... Oh. Like the thing's ready. <laughs> I'm gonna kill this because I want the build trophy supplies. There it is. I have to skin this, I can't throw it in the back, can I? You were inspired to draw a black legendary elk, and it's always been your favorite. Oh, let's go. Harry's going to be mad at me now. I haven't killed that man. I've been giving her samples. I mean, I've been prodding little critters for ages. Yeah, you see, I'm not sure if you can hear the uh, the audio that happens after that. It, it happened twice, because uh, I have to... It's actually, that was the hardest part to actually do, is get the audio to chime uh, on time um, when it was ready. And I'm going to have to go back to the drawing board to see if I can, yeah, get that working correctly. It should be easy, but it's a new language done. Not really familiar with, so. But it's quite handy to keep. Yeah, it's nice to have a little bell to remind you. Where is this? Just disappear off my map. Did too. Alright. Just waiting for my map to or my my camp to spawn back. There it is. Oh, nice. I do have to go up around. The Pelts and carcasses you get from free roam legendaries as well isn't as good as what you get from the Harriet sighting missions. They work a lot more. Which is unfortunate. So 
Hello, freeloader. <laughs> Thanks, Ray. Okay, so mate. Supplies are running down fast. That's top notch. Didn't particularly want to kill. I don't even know if I have a hunting wagon. Should do at least one sale, I suppose. Hmm. Cause I do need to get that up so I can get the hunting wagon ready. Howdy, Jose. Am I playing in a private lobby? I am playing in um, if you see, there's a little thing that there's a network. It's not a private lobby. Although I should have probably gone into just a private lobby. But, uh, I actually just changed my net my network settings. So that it just keeps, um, preventing people from joining on me. There's usually wolves around here. The uh, Timberland wolves. They're, I think it's usually night time you get the better. Usually night time there. The better result of this. This will be where you get the Timberland wolves. never wolves when you want them jack yeah they're always there when you don't vegetarians in the comments you might want to to look away now uh, what are my thoughts and predictions on this year state of the game and the future um, I think we it's just gonna be what we see like as in I don't think there's just gonna be event months and then you'll have the Halloween stuff back you probably get the halloween pass two back again then you'll have the halloween call to arms there might be <laughs> there might be uh some um there might be some straight uh, what you call telegram missions or something but there's not going to be any i'll use the word substantial content i don't think don't be added to this game something <laughs> for better effect yeah well to be fair i did say look away if you didn't want it it's uh, getters when you need big game. Yeah, that's it. When you're even looking for getters, they're gone as well. Goddamn bolt. We'll drop this in. Yeah, they usually come. I think you have a better. Like, they do spawn during the day as well, but I think they have a better spawn rate at nighttime. You just don't want them. Yeah, this is probably the better place I've got them. Don't say here, boy. We call it Tigers then. <laughs> maybe. Maybe Harriet won't know the difference. Getting a 
on supplies here. Yeah, it's probably another 20 minutes left in the supplies. Because I think they stopped it once I ran low on materials. I can do a sale though. So I might do that. Do with the cash. And I, I don't even have the large delivery wagon yet, so. Where am I on the map? I'm up near Cumberland Forest, Tyler. Is bait effective in this game? That's no, I don't think so. I don't even think I use it in single. I think I tried to use it. And it was just kind of useless. I, d I don't think I had much success in it. But maybe I'm wrong. Anyone else in the comments? Anyone used it and had actually more success with it? Carnivore bait is getting your friend to walk into the That's it, Jack. <laughs> Tell him there's a, like a, a secret gold bar stash just in there in the woods. Wait, yeah, like maybe it does work, but like I haven't had. I think I used it for, for. I think I tried it like in the single player and it just didn't have much use. Like even with the fish bait. I don't know. Like, <laughs> as in, like, I do have a lot of videos where I kind of, like, I was working off. I have um, a book that had like all the, that had all the, um, like a guide, the official guide for it. So I had that, and they were saying different baits had different success rates. But for the life of me, like, I don't know. I I, I don't know if that was the actual case. Don't bring it here. There's a gold bar near the barricade. Yeah. To feed the cats in this game. <laughs> All right, cool. We got a nice spot, actually. It's, uh, it's probably the, the best I could have helped hope for. Now, I want them. Oh, sick. That's a big message. I'll read it in a sec. Oh cool, I got handbrake turns in this ca this horse now. Moving up in the world. I wonder I should have the stew as well, like treat it yeah, I should have that stew. You had 11 cents. You could have bought yourself a nice meal over there in Tumbleweed and said you're, you're over here begging. You tie me? Tie me? There you go. Told you this business Margie was a piece of cake, didn't I? We are flying high now. Let me 
Let's see if I can do a resupply, I'll do that as well. Nope, still no resupply. Start distance. Yeah, I need the XP and I can do. Obviously, I'd wait for the full if I had a large wagon. R.I.P. one man Jenkins. Ah, well, you know, <laughs> he's better off now. He'll never be cold again or hungry. Baker's Cave. Okay. It's not that bad, I guess. We're going across the entire state, but... It's probably going to be a shootout at the end. Is there Quakers? He's in a better place now. He is, pigs. I'm sure Crips will cook him up as well. I could have probably put some shine on as well, actually. I'll, I'll leave it. Next time I stream, I'll do some shine on Trader Cells. I kind of just wanted to get the bit of the Nastrous roll up, but while I'm here, I might as well be Trader. Once you get to level 5 of Naturalist, and you can just Naturalist, you get the um, legendary animal sighting missions, and that's it. <laughs> Crisp, legendary, crispy hobo. Did I play Ragnarok? I didn't, actually. I didn't play it. I played the first game. I played, well, you know what I mean. Like, as in the first remake. Could it be a remake? Well, I played like um, the last game. Yeah, that's right. But so I played the last God of War game, but I didn't play the Ragnarok. I might play it sometime. Did you play it yourself? The 2018 one. Yeah, that's it. Oh. Hey. Hey. What did Jack say? You seem feel oddly hungry after seeing the man burning alive. Okay, yeah, it's not worrying. playing the first one yeah it's a good game i enjoyed it i just didn't have the time to play ragnar of the father son yeah i thought it was a good way of like the some of the lead de de developers are in that stage of their life as well you know um so it was a nice transition i thought I, I still think that I played Red Dead Redemption 2 and I played, um, oh yeah, it was 28. And I played, um, uh, obviously, uh, God of War. And I, I still think that God of War, should, like, I don't think it should have got Game of the Year. I think Red Dead should have got Game of the Year. I, I don't understand why God of War got Game of the Year. Red Dead has way more, um, depth to it. Like, it's not, like, I felt, the, like, I like God of War, like, there's, it does, you know, the fighting's pretty good now, responsive, um, narrative is good, but I, I always felt, like, the world looks cool, but I just felt it didn't, it just felt kind of like, like, there was no NPCs, and everything was an enemy, um, just felt like levels, really, more than an open world, whereas, like, Red Dead, Rockstar always kind of makes it kind of try to almost feel like it's, it's lived in, you know, it, it existed before you played it, and it'll exist after you stop playing it, like, Rockstar's really good at doing that, 
Whereas I just felt that game felt a bit more like everything was kind of window dressing and stuff. I, I feel The Witcher is similar to that, but I think I just prefer The Witcher map design, I think, a lot more. I think The Witcher did a really good world design. At least there was a bit. So many PCs, I guess. Um, do you have any idea how to get a solo lobby in Xbox? Uh, if you know how to change your MTU settings, you should be able to do it that way. That's what I'm doing here. Other than that, if you maybe look up the poker table glitch, but you'd need another player, player to help you do that. It's not something I cover on this channel. And mainly because I just don't want them to patch it. I was like, is that a treasure map? But now I can hear someone struggling. Just wait there. If you're still dying when I when I come back, I'll save you. I got a big long message a while back. Um, sexy. Uh, uh, yeah, sick. Dead. Good game. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff. There's a lot of um mods and stuff like um some people hosting their own servers and doing their own thing which you can see a lot of the potential there as well um and they have like hot air balloons and stuff like that as well like if if there was just <laughs> they didn't have a few people on development like they would be better i just think um they don't want to invest in anything else they don't want to invest another penny i'd love to have seen the i'd love to have seen the books on it but just i kind of knew for a while because every time they used to do their investor calls they'd always kind of give percentages when it was talking about gta and stuff and then when it came to reddit it was like oh it exceeded our expectations which is vague enough to More players are needed to see. Huh. Um, Red Dead should have got a game of the year. Yeah, I think so. I just, I think, um, he had the whole package. Like, I, th I do think God of War was a good game. I just think Red Dead had just more aspects that I think it was better at than God of War. But again, it's... See, I would have thought it was a subjective choice, but I mean... Like surely they have criteria that they're, they're voting on, so... I'm not exactly sure what their criteria is and like what boxes God of War ticked that Red Dead didn't. think there would have been more invested if the game 
No, I don't think so. Well, no, I think they plan to make Red Dead Redemption 2 and then start making Red De uh, GTA 6. That was always the plan. Um, do I think Red Dead Online would have got more? Um, well, I definitely think they would have started Red Dead Online with the idea that it would be a smaller version of GTA 6 or GTA Online. That it have at least a little bit of the success. They obviously didn't get that num get the numbers that they wanted, and they kind of dug their own grave as well a little bit with taking too long to release meaningful content and just having players just constantly playing while they didn't have like anything on the pipeline, and it was riddled with bugs. Like if it's, it has bugs now, but it, when it first launched, it was almost unplayable half the time. Um, Okay, this will be fun because I don't have my ability cards. Oh, shock on it. See here. Uh, bit of extra gold here as well. Uh, true hug, but feels... Where do I think RDR3? I'm not gonna lie, I've... I don't have a huge, um, desire for GT. Like, for me, Red Dead always... was always narrative-driven. Like, I what I loved about Red Dead 1 and 2 is very narrative-driven. Um, plus just the world. And I don't know... If Rockstar has it in them to make another good Western game. They might make another good GTA game. I don't think they could make another good... Well, I don't think they could. Um, Even look at the, some of the narrative choices they were making. For like GTA on Red Dead Online. Like... Great. So I wouldn't be... I'm not overly... Like, if they announced Red Dead Redemption 3 coming. I wouldn't be overly excited. I'm more, I'd be more excited for GTA 6. Uh, and I'd be more excited for Red Dead Online content. It was just me. But I don't think we have to anticipate GTA 6, or Red Dead, Red Dead 3 anyway. Wouldn't it have to be based off Jack, maybe? Uh, where are you gonna go with that though? Like, is in is it a Western game if you follow on Jack? As in the whole Red Dead One was always the ending of the era. That was the whole theme of the whole thing, which they touched off as well in Red Dead Redemption Two. But like that Western, it's kind of ended. So if anything, I'd rather if they went further back. Like I'd want to see more of the Wild West. I don't really want to see. Peaky Blinders in San Denis kind of thing, like, you know? That's a different game. Jackie Rooney. Red Dead Redemption 2. Red, Red Dead. Already RDR will all be out about you. Oh, that's nice. That's very considerate of them. Nice. You're a 
lost them around. I'm gonna head up to G while I'm here. I'm gonna head to tall trees and see if I can do a few more Sam. It really doesn't feel right now that I'm in. Yeah. Like it's like I I I can understand why people would think Jack would be. It's like, it makes sense, as in, that's where else could you go, but I don't, it's a different game, then. It's not a Western genre. Which you could probably do. But, yeah, it's just a different game. I think then they have um, a game called Agent. I'm not sure when that was. That was in the pipeline for a while. I'm not sure what era that was. I think it could have been World War. I'm not sure if it was World War One or Two. But, like, that could possibly link into that, like. But again, it would just wouldn't be a Wild West game. Yeah. I think it's up here. I have to get bears as well, I think. Yeah. Driver says, since Dan Hauser left, the yeah, that was it. Um, since, yeah, once, like, he was the main writer, a lot of the big, like, direction, lead direction people in the company have gone, so, I think they could get away with it, like, it, it's possible, like, GTA 6, I'm cautiously optimistic, I guess, I mean, I'm a little worried it's going to be a Saints Row, like, it'll just be kind of Saints Row, um, but if it is, it is. And, but I, I, I'm still, I, I love playing GTA Online. So they can probably get that right. Um, I don't know if the single player experience will be as good as 5 or 4. Or even the, the HD version. It's very difficult to make a satire game today anyway. Like so, And that's what like GTA was. A lot of childish humor. <laughs> Like it, like it is, um, but it was always wrapped in satire as well. So, yeah, it was really good at like giving a satirical depiction of the society and stuff. So, I don't think they can get away with that anymore. Which I think Sam Hauser is on record for even saying that you'd never be able to make GTA Five today. Like, so I would imagine that's probably why he left. these guys. I thought it was only like a three or four. They didn't really organize their main correctly like GTA 6 will be just average. Yeah, I think so. I think that's probably, yeah, I think that's exactly what it'll be. Um, I think it'll get, if it's just average, I think there'll be a lot of negativity around it. Like, um, because they have high expect, a lot of people have high expectations. I don't know if they can meet it. Um, I think the online version could be all right. Which is a shame. I mean, like Rockstar is obviously one of my, was anyway one of my favorite de developers like so it is a, a shame but these things happen like uh what's gta 6 going to have that gta 5 didn't 
what's it gonna have a well see that's it gta 6 will have it just a different story like um and there is there's lots of stuff they can add i mean you could say like what does call of duty iteration like yeah very little in the although I, I was gonna say there's very little in this like steps forward and innovation usually in games i suppose rockstar was always fucking that trend like gta 4 was significantly better than 3 and gta 5 was significant well yeah i'm gonna say it was significantly better than 4 but i i do like a lot of mechanics that in 4 that they don't have in 5 like the ragdoll physics and i actually like the, the car driving mechanics as well if you get the hang of it Hey James, how are you getting on? Uh, GTF, yeah, I think Mini, that's another thing, like, they can. From what I saw as well on the leaked footage, it does look very, like, Red Dead. Um, mechanics for the gun, stuff like that. Alright, this is where the... This should be where the... Rams are. Looks like a ram track. Nope, I would. The new cloud story was alright. I don't know. I'm, I've never. I've never really played Call of Duty. But I'd never have bought them for the story. I thought they were just like PvP games, certainly. I've got trust issues after the last time. spawn here I'm just kind of ran down just to see if I can kind of reset the spawn rate they also spawn up near they also spawn up like near um, Valentine well the mountain range just north of Valentine well, Yeah, I, I got, I got murked by a kitty. Might as well not waste it anyway. Get the sample. Maybe I'll just go and just toss in all the samples and see how much I get for it. I was kind of saving them to see if I could get more complete sets, but I don't really care. Could just.
Make sure you have those here. I'm slowly getting back into my, my accuracy. Is slowly get better. This, it always happens to me if I play another game or something. It takes me a while to readjust. I'm gonna fly down and come back again. Oh. I thought it was one. Oh, I'm down. That kitty wasn't happy I put him to sleep. Should have killed him before I killed him. He also seems to have built up a resistance to those uh, tranks. Just a cougar magnet today, yeah. It's cougar night, right? That online. I leave the body there as a warning to any other kitty cats. in all the samples. I'll get XP for them all anyway. You get more XP for some of the more dangerous animals. Probably just going to be more efficient to, to do that. Yeah, that's, that's fine. Let's go find a uh, crazy lady. Actually, by yeah, a gambler roll that'd be kind of cool. Well, I don't know if that'd be a bigger role, but it'd be nice for like a small kind of update. Um, because they do have the gambling casino thing, I think they just had trouble with um, like gambling in video games is kind of a sketchy area and it can get you banned in a lot of countries there they won't allow that like but they did do the casino heist so So I nearly marked myself there. I was trying to read the com keep an eye on the comments. A sheriff role. Yeah, like like surely cops and robbers and stuff like yeah. They kind of did a little bit of that with the you know, you, you kinda of did that with the Um Land of Opportunity missions where you could be kind of, like you were helping Sheriff Davies or you were uh helping Samson so they could have kept that going a bit more and following one of those roles would have opened up like either a criminal underworld or would have opened up a 
you know, more Pinkerton kind of stuff. Or that's how they kind of, you know, there, look, there's a lot of stuff they could have done. Um, all they lacked, I guess, was imagination or the motivation. And yeah, the bounty hunter does. I suppose the bounty hunter, yeah, I suppose it would have been, if you had a show, it would be more the same, I guess, actually, yeah. It'd just be cool if you could, like, get more stuff for it, though. Get a sheriff badge. Get more missions where you'd, like... It would have made more sense as well if you are doing the, um, call to arms. You know, that theme. I don't have time. Oh, I had up to sell my samples. A rancher wrangler roll, yeah. Yeah, I would like. I think everyone would love those in properties, like everyone. Like, which isn't, I don't think, uh, too much of a. Like, I don't think people's expectations were too far off that you'd end up having some sort of a property they even added the moonshiner shack and stuff like so it's when you looked at re how red dead online's model was it kind of made sense that could have got something like that any idea how to fix the fff error Often it's uh, to do with network, um, so it could be your internet. If you can try it out with a different internet connection or something. Um, that bear. I jumped off a little too quick. <laughs> I feel guilty now. Oh, we got a grizzly sample, which is always nice. Got to toss in all these. Hope she doesn't hear about. Hope she didn't hear about the. Uh, oh no, she knows. Concerned. Don't gas me. A trade? What do you yeah, I'm just gonna sell everything. One of our smaller friends, but no less important. Some large mammals are so graceful despite their size. Small, but often very fast. You were brave for getting this sample. Thank you. This beautiful creature is not so different from you or me. Practically the same. You've got quite the collection of those, huh? Can you imagine molting as a human? I wish I could some days. Surely I would have leveled up from that. Okay, I never saw the level up thing. We're getting there. Just a few, few more gators, and I think I'll I'll be set. But I'm gonna finish up the stream here. I'll probably stream again during the week just to get up that to where I wanted. <laughs> Look, yeah, I didn't see didn't spray me. Yeah, <laughs> I don't think I, you have to like build up a kill a certain amount before she'll spray you. Like she she won't. She'll turn a blind eye for a certain amount of times, but yeah, she'll spray you after a while. Yeah, massive thanks to everyone who joined. Hope you enjoyed the stream, and I will put a bit of work into getting Red Dead 1 ready for a stream as well, as I'd enjoy doing that. All right, people, I'll catch you all again. Hope you enjoy the rest of your days, and catch you again. Three years out here. It's gone by so fast.